Welcome to Special Angel Art Dolls. I'm Nicole and I'm an adult doll collector who creates content here on YouTube for other adult doll collectors to enjoy. And yes, guys, it's all about Aslan today because it's her birthday. She's been with me a year. And to be honest with you, I don't usually commemorate the birthdays of my small babies. Now, Lyndon has one. Lyndon is my big child doll. Um, but I just, I don't remember the dates that I got all of them, and I don't have documentation of all those dates. However, getting Aslan was a very, very special experience. And um, I rewatched the box opening the other day and realized that I received her and opened her on July 10th and I really wanted to um, bring her on and just make a video with her and talk about how special she is to me because she is so special, aren't you? Yes. So I'm going to take away her little bunny toy. I've got to have it, sweetie. I'm sorry. I'll give it back. Look. We'll put it over here, and we're going to get you dressed, and then you can have her back, okay? So I'm going to put her in this beautiful little dress with this adorable little Peter Pan collar, and it has like this, um, almost this wraparound design in front, and it is accompanied by these sweet little bloomers. Amy gave me this um, because it was a little bit big for any of her girls and um, we're going to see how it fits Aslan. It might be a little roomy on her too, but we'll see. We'll try. So I really um, enjoy putting her in little dresses like this. I cannot believe that I've had this sweet little girl for an entire year. Just can't believe it. It feels like yesterday. And there was so much coming up on the horizon at that time. It's just crazy that it's been that long. I don't know, this is going to fit nicely. So. Let's see, what's the year been like with Miss Aslan? Well, what's she done? So she has um, gone to spend nights at my grandmother's house. I'm gonna have to pick her up. Oh, and I love to pick her up. Oh, I love to pick her up. Maybe I should have brought this on the other way. I don't know if we're going to get it up like this. Oh, yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. <laughs> there we go. Now we can put you back. Yeah. We have to turn it, don't we? Yeah, because it's all sideways. That's not very good, huh? So she's spent nights with me at my grandmother's house. My grandmother absolutely loved her. She has moved with me, as they all did. Um, 
she has gone with me to work. Yes, I took her to work. Um, <laughs> so I have a coworker who just loves to joke around and everybody around him loves to joke around with him because he's just so, he's just so crazy and he's so funny. Um, so a coworker had made a joke that he better not be running into people because he has some, so many kids that, uh, he might, if he runs into women, you know, they might get pregnant. And it was just a silly joke. He, he has four kids. That's not that many. You know, oh, this fits her great. Let's see with her hair. I love that I don't really have to brush her hair. I can just smooth it with my hand. Yeah. Um, and so I took her to work on April Fool's Day. And I said, look, I've got a bone to pick with you. And I went up to him and I put her in his arms. <laughs> and everybody everybody was just shocked and just laughing and um i knew because his daughter has a reborn doll i knew that he would know like that he'd be gentle with her so i wasn't worried about that i'm just putting this big white uh flower bow headband on her there we go you look so sweet you do you look so sweet yeah oh my gosh that's so cute. Here you go. I'll give Bunny back now, huh? You can play with her ear. And look. Look, here's this little ring that you can kind of hold on to by putting your other hand through it. There we go. Now that's awkward. Here, let's do this one. Untwist her. There we go, let's do this one. <clears throat> Ooh, that's awkward too. Alright, well, there she is. There's she's holding the bunny. So yeah, she spent that day with me at work. And she made lots of friends. That was really fun. Um... And mostly she has just been an absolute delight to me because I'll tell you what, there's something special about this sculpt. I remember um, when I got my first Saskia, I remember saying, this doesn't feel like a doll. This feels like a baby in my arms. And um, of course, they're all supposed to feel like babies, right? And a lot of them do. But there's just something about the way that she's sculpted where it feels like she wants you to cuddle her. Um, and it feels like she... There's almost a sense of movement to her even though she doesn't move. I don't know, she just... There's something about this baby that just feels so real to me. Um, and I did experience that with my first Saskia as well. but. I would say it's even more so with Aslan. She just feels so real to me. So, um, happy birthday to Aslan. And <laughs> I think I love her more now than I did when I got her. So I just wanted to bring her on on her special day for you all to see. Um, I'm glad that a lot of you love her too. And, um, yeah. So there she is, the birthday girl. Still beautiful. And she's brought joy to lots of people, maybe more than most of my babies have. And that makes me happy. So, just a short, quick one today, but. Thank you all for being here and for celebrating my sweet special girl with me. And until next time, take care, be kind, and God bless. Bye.